good afternoon or good evening it's us again here we are my poor baby she's sad she's got a problem with her iPad no, your iPad is it not your iPad iPad 4B um, for some reason her Apple ID is not working and she's very sad my poor baby don't worry darling I fix when I go home you sure I yeah, sure you really care for IT but you cannot make you not number one okay I'm number one no you I'm I tell one. for people to know first him say him say him can help me for yeah, free. Yeah. but when they give him him not say me cannot make for it okay yeah you tell me you really are special uh, IT yeah 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 but I want to know you can just only ID you can yeah well I can't fix your ID you you forgot your password so I can't fix okay. that Anyway, look, I'm going to cue the, <laughs> cue the intro. I, I tell you before, not my password. I have a long password. I don't know. What's the deal? You don't know. Somebody's reset your password. Yeah, I didn't yeah. read that. So we'll have to fix it, okay? Okay. No problem. Okay. All sorted out. Anyway, we'll cue the intro. No, we're not fighting. We're just trying to just work out some stuff. But it is one thing that's always sort of amazed me about this, you know, the, the Thai attitudes to IT. Um, like I've had to deal with it, you know, since we opened our office here in 2005. Uh, I'm sure that uh, they all think it's just a magic black box, these computer systems. And, you know, it all just works when you turn it on. But, you know, being in the IT field, you just know how uh, inaccurate that particular statement is. Uh, you know, your, 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 your login IDs and your passwords, they're, they're like your signature. You know, uh, if you give them to other people, if you log into other people's devices with these things, guess what? You're going to get your accounts hacked. Oh my God, seriously. And it's just amazing. Like, you know, I've tried to teach her for the last, you know, eight years about the importance uh, of these IDs and passwords. I've even showed her my last past, um, you know, a system which stores all my account IDs and complex passwords because it's just got to the point that you simply yeah, you simply cannot um, uh, run around the internet these days with a single password um, the place is, is ripe for all sorts of problems um, anyway I wasn't going to just have a, a, an IT discussion tonight I was just going to give you guys a bit of an update um, sure, like if you want me to do some instructional videos on uh, how to survive the internet, um, look, I'm the person, I'm the go to person for that. I'll tell you how to secure your passwords, how to manage your accounts, how to use, you know, like um, um, what they call uh, uh, dual authentication systems, and how to get around, you know, uh, you know, like and not get hacked. But uh, like I said, you know, like this channel's really what you have here. You want to try the patrol? Mmm, good, good. So, um, anyway, look, I just gotta, I just gotta buy something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, anyway, as I said, so like you know, I'm, you know, I'm pretty up the top there at the top echelon of IT infrastructure. Like, I was on a six-figure income, you know, of a multinational firm that uh, appreciated all my good advice. And it still amazes me how these people who run sort of, you know, shops think that they're better than me. I'm sorry, it just doesn't get, doesn't work in my world. Anyway, getting back, so we're going to do a bit of channel update. Uh, well, I don't know, it's a channel update, just what's happening. Um, yeah, so we had the passing of the Kings, uh, the, the final cremation uh, last Thursday. Uh, that was a very interesting event. Uh, uh, you know, the video is already up for that. Obviously, it's not a time of recording this. Uh, I think the video comes out next Thursday. But aside from that, uh, uh, what else we got? We got uh, Loy Katrong coming up. Uh, this Friday's coming up, Loy Katrong. Uh, that's the candle flooding ceremony. So, uh, I'm not quite sure where we're going for that yet. Um, I know we did it at a local temple uh, last year. Um, but it was a very somber event because it was only just after the passing of the king and pretty much all of those events were put into a very very low key um, obviously now that the funeral has been finished i think uh, all the government agencies actually get to wear something apart from black 
as from tomorrow or tomorrow or next I'm not quite sure um, what exact day it was but yeah so they uh, uh, government offices uh, they uh, finally move out of morning uh, if you start to see things in Thailand uh, get back to normal um, well in you know in a I think it it's already is pretty much normal at the moment, but um, you know, the whole mourning period is officially uh, over now, which is uh, um, you know great for you know, Thailand in general. Uh, they get on to move on with their life and uh, start to appreciate the benefits of the uh, the reigning monarch, and um, you know get to know uh, him uh, better. I know there's some interesting discussions around in some of the webs, of, and he's not a very uh, well-respected um, uh, monarch in some circles. Uh, I don't really pay much ear to that. Um, all I know is the fact that uh, he studied in Australia, he studied overseas, uh, he studied with the Australian Air Force. Um, you know, that obviously counts something in my book as something good. So, um, you know, exactly you know, where he's going to lead the country, uh, that's really up to the, the people in charge. Anyway, enough about the whole uh, monarch, uh, uh, well, the whole system of government here. I don't even want to have that discussion either. It's not really what my channel's about. Um, yeah, so what else is happening? Um, well, we're at uh, Daylight World again, as you can see, if you can see in the background. Uh, well, she gets some food. <laughs> what are you eating now, darling? What's your order? What's your order? Oh, rice, yes. Um, so, uh, yeah, so I think one of the things that's coming up in the next uh, couple of weeks, um, B suggested we go away camping somewhere um, up north of, uh, not quite sure how far north, I know it's past the Utia. I think it's up near uh, one of the central provinces, or probably even up near the mountains of the central provinces. Um, she showed me some photos and I did a quick Google search on that one, and uh, yeah, it's it's roughly you know between us and and Laos, um, so it's a good way to the city. So we're going to spend a couple of days up there. That'll be a few videos um, uh, of rural and uh, adventure style life. Um, I had somebody on my channel today ask me why we don't do more of these uh, uh, out and about you know uh, videos, uh, you know, for more of the you know the more of the destinations around Thailand. Well, you know, I, I answered that one on, on the on the on the forum, or well, on the forum on, on, on my um, on my comments section. But really, most people don't understand the fact that you know I keep on saying, you know, I'm living you know a Thai suburban lifestyle here. Um, you know, as with anybody, I I, I don't have to work here. Yeah, that's one thing. Um, but you know, everything life still goes on as normal around uh, Thailand, and you know. I'm not going to spend uh, you know, my hard-earned retirement income you know, cruising around Thailand every week just to satisfy a video blog, uh, which doesn't make an income. Yes, um, I could certainly do that. Uh, yeah, you can get some of those ones for me. Yeah, so that's one thing. You know, like I don't, I don't drive a, uh, what I call a, 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 a tourism income from my video blog. I make a few dollars to, you know, pay for my website and a few other things like that. Um, that's all good. It's all, uh, more than I expected from a video blog. But um, other than that, uh, uh, you know, we're we're a, we're a couple enjoying our time together. You know, we can have just as good a time here in Bangkok, the two of us, as what anybody can running around um, the outskirts of Thailand. He wants to go back to America, of course. Um, so, and now of course the other sort of side of it is the fact that, uh, you know, I'm living in Thailand. Um, you know, I think uh, it's very hard to try to sort of, you know, have people understand that, you know, living in Thailand, it's not, you know, like I've got all my life to visit all the sites and sort of, you know, places around Thailand. I don't have to do it in one year or six months or three months or, you know, on a holiday visa. Um, I've got all my life to enjoy those things without any rush. Um, you know, the, the channel's growing. Uh, then we're coming close to 15 other subscribers. Uh, we average a, a thousand views per video, which is 
probably more than most channels uh, with twice the number of subscribers. Um, so we've got a fairly well engaged audience. Um, definitely I would like to see more uh, communication on uh, the comments section. But I do know that's a sort of, you know, like a recipe for some people just want to stay clear of that. So, as I said, we've mentioned uh, um, the Thailand Desk, so that's a place that I frequent and um, I'm an active participant in that community there. Uh, another thing that's happened recently is um, I finally got my finger out and uh, resurrected my, my old website domain and I've now still turned that into a blog. Um, and I will now start posting out from that location, uh, hopefully to uh, get better engagement again. Basically, it'll give uh, uh, other people you know, on my channel another place to interact. What's the matter, darling? She doesn't like me talking so much. What's the matter, baby? Popcorn. Popcorn. Yes, I know. Yeah. She doesn't think I love her. What do you think? You think we look good together? Pardon? Only me. Only you. Smile for the camera. Yeah. Oh my god. Why are you so beautiful, darling? I don't know. I'm crazy. <laughs> She's crazy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I really sort of still like, I don't know, some people don't like the market videos that I do, but I think it's just amazing just watching all these people mulling around, getting their evening meals. Uh, you know, and that's really what it is. We've got to our left here, we've got the whole food produce, you know, like the, uh, the fresh foods and the, you know, the butchers. And then, of course, you know, in the corridors here, you have the, you know, the stalls that actually do the cooking part of that produce. And you have everybody mulling around. It's actually it's just, it's just a hive of activity. Uh, and it's already seems like the fact that uh, there's a lot more vibrancy in the crowd already. So that's only three days after uh, the final formation of the king. I don't know, maybe that's what I'm looking for. It's hard to tell. What do you guys think? But you know, it definitely is like I just market lifestyle, great bargains, great time to get some great food. Um, and over the next few years, I'll get to try some of the more of the exotic delicacies uh, that are that are uh, here to be sampled. No, Darren Freebee, you don't have to fear me from taking over your channel. Uh, I'm not a foodie. Uh, I like my food though. Yeah, so now that I've got my website up and running, it'll take a few, so probably a month or so to really get it up to where I want it as a uh, place where everybody can, you know, safely come and interact with our channel um, and uh, be off that, you know, cesspool of a YouTube platform. Um, and hopefully this will create more engagement with our, with our audience. Um, because that's, you know, like you said, I do this for the people who watch the channel, you know. <laughs> Where he's buying something. You know, the whole YouTube channel thing, I, <laughs> I have no, no want to be the next Casey Neistat. Well, I can't really say I wouldn't appreciate the sort of income in that uh, You know, like I can really sort of do a, a Johnny There Is Something Happening lifestyle with that sort of income, or even worse. <laughs> but, you know, you know, I'm on a budget. Uh, I worked my budget, I keep my budget as for the last video. Um, and uh, I don't go overboard. Uh, we have an absolutely wonderful life and we don't have any stress. Um, which is something that people that uh, don't understand uh, about how the financial things work. Um, like today I had an email, a private email from, from uh, somebody who obviously watches the channel. He wanted to you know, indicate or show me some information that's being set on other people's channels you know, like you know obviously from people who are homophobic or something of that nature right who have a, an issue with shopping up there, um, but quite honestly you no know, look I know a lot of stuff a lot of stuff gets said about our channel outside our channel but uh, hey look you know, that, you know I really don't care right it's my life, and it's fucking better than these assholes that want to fucking complain about. Seriously, I have no idea. 
But anyway, look, uh, I do try to keep the swearing to the absolute bare minimum. Uh, um, but, uh, you know, I, I have a good life. We have a good life. Um, and I'm pretty sure most of the problems we have is just people being envious of the lifestyle. They don't know how to break out of the traps. Well, guys, that's what I'm here for, you know? Contact me, get in touch with me. Right? I'll tell you where you can sort of make some changes in your life. Well, I won't tell you it's right or wrong. Right? That's up to you guys, you know? But I can tell you some things that I've done in my life that made it possible for me to get out of that freaking rat race, right? That's what I'm here for, right? That's what most of us Thai vloggers are trying to do, right? We're showing you the fact you don't have to be a slave to the system, right? Wake up, you know, hashtag woke. I'm crying out loud. People are just so, um, I don't know what the word is, right? They, they, they live the same day in and out expecting something different to happen. No, it doesn't work that way, guys, right? You have to make a change. You can't change the governments on your own, right? So you have to make a change. If you want to make a change, it's up to you, right? This is not going to change for you, guys. I don't know whether it's just this Sunday night, uh, uh, after the King's passing, uh, but the market looks twice the size and twice as busy as it was uh, last time of year. I don't know if that's an indication of that you know, the morning period actually is truly over. So just cruising or browsing this second hand shop here, just saw this camera <laughs> going, damn, I had something almost the same back in the early 80s. Uh, which is quite interesting, uh, given the fact that I just started to watch the second season of um, Stranger Things, which is set in, I think, 1984, and it's just, uh, they really have done a great job of sort of, you know, creating that illusion of the fact that you're in the middle 80s, you know, when it's 2017 and we've all got these great mobile phone things that sit on our pocket all the time, <coughs> right? Taking video back of the 80s <laughs> was a labour of love carrying around big battery packs you know if you were out more than any more than an hour um, carrying the battery packs around just to power the thing up and, and they were those cameras of luggables I wish I still had the videos from those days but unfortunately as VHS goes it doesn't last forever and we never really got it re-encoded to a digital format which is a shame so we're just wandering along there bought something for mother uh, she's off to Sukhothai for another couple of weeks again um, and uh, a Thai uh, gentleman just wandered up and said I've seen your channel <laughs> and I saw your video here for Dalot World Market last time yeah oh my god so here's me thinking it was only this um, it was only uh, uh, Americans English and Australian people watch the channel well I know it's more than that I do see the analytics but uh, to actually have a Thai person come up and say I love your channel <laughs> oh my god <laughs> that's just saying something else so again it just comes down to all those haters out there that want to troll YouTube you know, like you're a minority <laughs> just give up <laughs> yep <laughs> but anyway look I'm gonna wrap this up we're gonna go and find some food um, and uh, eat some food have a beer and then head off home anyway so don't forget the next video will be the Loikatrong uh, flower, flower, flower or floating um, flower festival thing. Um, so keep tuned for that. And, and bye bye for now. Good boy. Good boy. Time for eat food. Bye bye. Love you guys. See you later. See you guys. <laughs>